Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. In this video we are going to solve this logical reasoning problem. We have three expression 4 plus 2 equal to 6, 4 plus 4 equal to 14 and we need to find what will be equal 4 plus 6. So what the pattern between all of these expressions? Run through it here on the right hand side you have a lot of options A, B, C and D. So right now let's check your IQ. So put one, choose one option and write your option in a comment. What do you think this number it will be? 10, 22, 17 or 19. And after video, after 20 seconds, we will check your check your knowledge. So let's try to find the pattern between all of these all of these expressions. So right here, take a look. We have 4 plus 2 equal to 6. We know that 4 plus 2 equal to 6 is correct. But what about the second row? We have 4 plus 4 equal to 14, <coughs> which is not correct. So let's find the pattern between all of these numbers. I see right now a really good pattern between all of these. Take a look. If you multiply these two numbers, so we will have 4 times 2. We will have 8. We will have 8. So just multiply these two numbers. We will have 8. And take a look. The second row. Let's use the same logic. So 4 times 4. We will have 16. So as you can see, this and this is not, if not the same. But take a look closely. What the difference be between these first numbers? I see right now that if we subtract from this 8, if we subtract 2, so right here minus 2, and right here if we subtract from this 16, if we subtract 2 as well, as you can see, minus 2, we will have a really interesting case. We will have our pattern. So right here, take a look, multiplying these two numbers and in the end subtract from this number, from this value 2. Right here, multiplying these two numbers and subtract 2 as well. So as you can see, 16 minus 2 will be 14 and 8 minus 2 will be 6. So let's use this logic, let's use this. Maybe we will have this option in the end. So take a look, 4 times 6 using the same logic, multiplying this, these two numbers, we will have what? We will have 24 and the pattern between all of these numbers we need to subtract, subtract 2. So from this 24 we need to subtract 2. And as you can see, our final answer, 24 minus 2, we will have 22. And this will be our answer. And take a look, maybe, we'll have, maybe we don't have this option. So it will be really and funny because we don't have any option. And take a look, we have this option. Option B is correct. So if you still have any question, maybe you have another pattern between all of these, all of these expressions. So it will be really and but I found this one. So our, my option is option B. Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next videos.